Have you looked into where you might spend part of the 24 hours with the Lord? Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and while it's true that God is everywhere and at any time and in any place we can put ourselves in God's presence, and while it's true that Jesus is present in an even more special way through his Eucharistic presence in the churches and tabernacles of the world, still, something very special will be happening this weekend. For the third year in a row, Pope Francis has decreed that some churches in every diocese, including St. Peter's Basilica, will be open for 24 straight hours from this Friday evening until Saturday evening. During that time, the Blessed Sacrament will be exposed for adoration and the Sacrament of Reconciliation will be available. Here's how the Pope sees this time. First, we can pray in communion with the Church on earth and in heaven. Let us not underestimate the power of so many voices united in prayer. The 24 Hours for the Lord initiative is meant to be a sign of this need for prayer. Yes, more than ever, the world needs prayer. Our church needs prayer. Each one of us needs prayer. Prayer opens our hearts to God's love and mercy, which then flow through us to all the places and people in our world that are in desperate situations and who need our loving attention. Jesus prayed and he taught his disciples to pray. On his last night on earth, he asked his apostles to stay awake and to pray with him. Won't you join him in prayer sometime this weekend?